In this video, I'll show you how to crop or put a picture or image inside a shape using Canva. Hi, my name is David, and if this is your first time watching my videos and you get value from the content that you watch, kindly consider giving this video a like and share it with your friends so that we can all learn together. So, by the end of this video, you should be able to do something like this. So, this is uh, just uh, a template uh, for a Facebook post, uh, the dark blue woman photo. And having a picture inside a shape is a good way to consolidate things and make things look good. For example, this picture looks really good. Uh, and if you have the paid version, then the logo will, uh, the Canva logo will not be available. But you can easily understand uh, the message being displayed here. So let's go back to a blank uh, template here. Uh, and let's say we just want uh, to, uh, for example, I have an image here, uh, this image of me and my wife. Uh, and I just want to put it inside a shape and then either crop her out or something of the sort. Uh, maybe I want to use the, the image for something else. So I'll just come into uh, the elements here and then scroll down until you get to frames. Uh, uh, I prefer to use the frames because uh, these are more or less like transparent and all you need to do is just drag and drop uh, your picture inside. So let's say we want to do a circular photo. Uh, that's really popular. And we just draw, uh, drop in our frame inside here. And then uh, we'll just go to the uploads and then select our photo and then just drag and drop it. Once we drop it inside uh, the circular frame, uh, it's going to adjust. So let us say we uh, I just wanted to take out my wife and then just leave myself in here. I can just click on crop. And what happens is that uh, the image is going to be highlighted. So you can just make the adjustments as you wish. So I'll just hold the end here and pull it up to somewhere like that and then click on done. And all we have now is just my face and all that, uh, just a headshot. So this is a good way uh, to actually do that and it's pretty simple. Uh, something else you can do, maybe you can decide to like add uh, a shape uh, with some color. Let's say we just drag and drop a shape here and then we can just slightly adjust it uh, like that. And then let's say we position backward. So you see there's uh, a circular shape with a dark color. Uh, let's say we change the color. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, control Z. Uh, let's say, uh, let's just do control Z again. Uh, we bring it forward. Let's say we add uh, this particular color. Uh, control Z and then let's just click on this change the color and then let's position it at the back so we have my photo uh, with a good uh, like circular uh, purplish color uh, to go with it so if that is all you wanted you can export this and if you have the pro you can export with a transparent background uh, you can also now start either uh, group this and then you can make the the edits together uh, so that you can add your text or message the way you want uh, like we've already seen here so for example here we can just remove this image let's just delete and you see this is just a circular frame and then we can look at some photos here let's say uh, begin with the trend in mind let's say uh, need a style update uh, some of the photos here i just searched for lady uh, let's say this photo looks good you can just drag it here uh, and uh, as it looks it drives curiosity and all that but we can just click and then crop and then try to adjust it slightly and then move it to that position and then just click on done and I think it looks good so uh, I can easily draw you in uh, to actually want to see uh, what style update uh, I'm going to be having when I uh, either use the product or whatever is being advertised. So that's how you can crop or put a picture or image inside a shape using Canva. Thanks for watching this video. I hope it has been of value. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning.